It's 635 days until midterm elections. Sounds like a while, right? Not to a right-leaning group that has started targeting Iowa's solo congressional Democrat, Dave Loebsack. KCRG TV 9's Forrest Saunders has the story. Dave Loebsack is the only Democrat representing Iowa in Congress. The second district political veteran has six House wins under his belt. With the exception of his first election, he's always had a pretty comfortable margin of victory, five points or more. Even so, some Republicans think he might be vulnerable. The reason? Trump. No one has ever campaigned this soon against me. That's what Congressman Loebsack said following the release of this ad from the American Action Network. Dave Loebsack voted for Obamacare, and Iowa families are paying the price. In it, the right-leaning nonprofit slams the Democrat for his support of the Affordable Care Act. AAN is currently using similar ads to target seven other congressional Democrats as well. Like Loebsack, all are in districts. Trump won in November. We deserve better. Loebsack's staff called the ad a Republican attack and pushed constituents for campaign funding in response. But AAN sees it differently. Um, so this is one way um, of us getting our message out there and making sure that the congressman knows that there is a better way. To Spokesperson Ruth Guerra says the commercials are part of a $1.3 million campaign started only to push for repeal and replacement of the ACA. That's even though the money is also paying for 16 ads supporting Republican congressmen like Rod Blum and their efforts fighting Obamacare. Rod Blum, thank him for fighting for a quality, affordable health care plan. Cornell political science professor Hans Hassel is more in line with Loeb sex thinking. Hassel believes GOP support groups see a potential weakness in Trump's swing in those districts. The professor thinks the ads may be a subtle call to arms to encourage a Republican challenger to step up. Not expected, but at the same time, it's not uh, rare either. There are there are a number of other places though, where Republicans have invested early or Democrats have invested early as a, as a way of signaling to other you know, potential candidates, hey, we will give you money and we'll invest in this race because we, we view it as being you know, potentially uh, uh, winnable. For Loebsack, he thinks improvements could be made to the ACA, but says he isn't planning on changing his stance. He wants to keep Obamacare right where it is. In Cedar Rapids, Forrest Saunders, KCRG, TV9 News.